Material girls, ball main bust down. These hoes can't stand us. These hoes ain't gonna never like us. You think I give a fuck, pussy? Yeah. Y'all know what the fuck going on on this channel, baby. This ain't no regular motherfucking tarot channel, period. But listen, y'all, let me stop playing. Let me be for real, cause cause um God is singing to me right now. He keep I'm hearing him say all or nothing. All or nothing. That's what I keep hearing him say, all or nothing. Sometimes y'all, and this is my real life. When stuff be going bad, like, for instance, let me say, if I don't have no way of making money, I don't have no money at all, and I'm on my last, right, I probably got $20 left. You know what I do? I go get that $20 away. I go completely broke. You feel me? It's like all or nothing. You feel me? You got to be able to, you got to be able to sacrifice everything. You got to be able to give everything over to God for God to bless you. You feel me? So don't never be afraid to just to just put it down. You feel me? If if you if you put it down, he who desires to save his he who desires to save his life will die. But he who lays his life down, Jesus will save it. You feel me? So you can't worry about your bills, about your circumstances, and all this stuff. You feel me? You gotta get that stuff over to God. When you give it over to God, it's either he going to take it away or he going or he going to come. When you need him to come, he going to come at the, right before it. Right before things hit the ceiling fan, he go God walking in saving your day. You feel me? And if you lose it, it it's just for God to bless you with something better. Don't be sad about it. It's all or nothing. You get what I'm saying? Because if you hit rock bottom, God has no choice but to come pick you up. You feel me? God got favoring over over First of all, God got favorite over humans anyways, but God got a special favorite over women, okay? Because what, to, to tell you the truth, let's be honest with you, God made women for men, okay? I'm, I'm a strong believer that men supposed to have took care of us. They really were supposed to have took care of us. But through, through the world and the corrupt, all this stuff, we got to take care of ourselves, so Jesus Christ is your husband. I literally had a dream of this man marrying me. Ever since me and Jesus got married, honey, this man been handling his responsibility as a man every time. Every time, friend. So it is what it is. He got to come through for us women. I promise you, we ain't asked to be here. He made us for a special purpose. And sometimes every woman, every woman this lifetime ain't going to step into that purpose. You feel me? And you can't be sad about it. You can't cry about it. That and that's why that's why it be so hard to find love, y'all, because we be crying and sad and keep thinking about it. You study thinking about a man, but you ain't getting no money. What the fuck? You want to be broken in a relationship? That's what you want. Go get a, go get a successful man. You don't need no man just because you love him. I'm here and get the fuck off that damn dating site. Is you stupid? You gonna go on a dating site to go find your husband because you that desperate? Friend, I love you so much to tell you right now your husband ain't on that dating site. That man that, that you feel that you feeling on that dating site, y'all. Whoever this man is, he just think you got money. He flexing right now. In a year or so, you're going to end up pregnant. Y'all going to get married. And the shit going to be the worst relationship you ever fucking been in in your life, bro. And you ain't going to want to leave because this everything. You you just want to be married. You just want somebody to love you. Here you go taking care of another man. Struggling. Having to work. Having to really live a slave life because you didn't want to be lonely. I don't really cry by myself than with somebody else. That's the honest to God truth. I don't know who needed to hear that, friend. But I will sit here by myself and cry every motherfucking night. <laughs> I'm so tired of being by myself. I can't take you. Oh, my God. I can't. But, bitch, I'm going to take it every night until I get the person that I want. See, you don't get what you pray for. You get what you wait for. <laughs> You don't get what you pray for. You get what you wait for. If you wait long enough, your blessing will come to you. The, every option is not your option. Stop just choosing stuff. Oh, this man like me, so I'm finna just go with the flow because he like me. And I don't want to be by myself and I don't even think another man gonna come like me. If this man like you, it's a thousand other men that's out here just like him that like you as well. And better versions. Honey, 
I'm, I'm single by choice, baby. I do tarot by choice. I can easily go slide. You know how many niggas slide in my DM friend? Do I need to screenshot it for you? Y'all have y'all know me from TikTok. I'm up almost 200,000 followers on TikTok. You know how many men come to me every day? Uh, yes, any choice, anyone, any, mini money, mo, pick a nigga, buy his total. But I ain't one of them niggas that I want. So I'm gonna wait this thing out. I'm gonna wait this thing out, period. For real, respectfully. respectfully. I'm gonna be on the top of y'all until the man of my dreams come to me. If he don't never come, bitch, I'm just gonna be helping y'all for the rest of my life. That's just what it's gonna be. Okay, for real, respectfully. Also, y'all, I wanna say, Follow that girl on Tarot Channel, okay? She is lit. She is lit. Friend, listen, let me tell y'all something. If I ever stop doing Tarot, my life changed all of a sudden, anything happened, this is where all my followers need to go to, right here. She on the same shit I'm on. Her stories damn near the same as my stories. Friend, you got to start posting every day. The girls want to see you. How, how you going to blow up on YouTube if you ain't posting every day? So I'm giving you a chance to win right now. I need a video from you every day. Because when it's my time to go and it's my time to leave, leave, they gonna need a new leader. And I don't pick no, I don't pick no anybody. You feel me? Like I really sit down. I might have shared some videos and stuff on my page because I am big on support and things like that. You feel me? I'm gonna support you support me, I'm gonna support you. It is what it is, you feel me? But I actually, re I actually watch y'all videos. I don't watch several people's videos. You feel me? Several a time. But this lady right here, and then it's so crazy because God even led me to her today. Said, hey, Jess, go watch this girl video. I go watch her video. She called my name out, in it? Material girl, about my name, but down, the old can't stand us. You feel me? So, yeah, if I ever got to leave, and my life ever changed, anything like this, y'all that's what y'all need to go ahead and tune over to her. You feel me? So, yeah. Everybody, I want y'all to spot. I want y'all to pause this video right now, respectfully. Run her shit up to a, a thousand followers, at least. At least get a girl a thousand. At least, friend. Come on, respectfully. I know a thousand people don't view this, this video. You feel me? And I know a thousand people fucks with me. Because y'all be the same thousand and come back every time. So can I get my die-hard followers that really fuck with me to go follow this girl right here, respectfully? Thank y'all. All right, y'all, this time I'm gonna get into the message. For some reason, I wanted to do one earlier, but God kept telling me to wait. Let's see, but let's go ahead and get into it. It say, it's up to you. So there's something that's coming, some type of decision that you're gonna have to make if you want this or not. You feel me? I feel like, um, you see the angel wings is opening. So I feel like you're finna be presented something or you, or you might be presented to somebody else or you might be pre presented something new. Take it however it resonates. This situation calls for forgiveness. So I feel like um, in order for you guys to get your new blessings, mm -hmm. forgive the past. Let the things go. It is what it is. You feel me? You can't hold on to, to sorrow and stuff that you stuff that got done to you in the past. You feel me? Yeah, your family hurt you, but it ain't no need to keep dwelling on that. I'm telling you, ball on, period. But I feel like whatever this situation is that you finna have to make a decision on, it's up to you if you want it. It's gonna cause for a situation of forgiveness. I feel like this is finna be, I was finna say, I feel like this is finna be somebody from your past, seven of swords, somebody who could have left, somebody who could have lied or deceived you. I ain't gonna lie, it's a new year with me, you know? I don't, I'm not going back to no past person. I don't care who it is, five of swords, that's what I'm saying. This person just coming in to lie, trick, um, manipulate you. This person could be greedy. Yeah, two of swords, y'all block this um connection out. I did just have an ex text me, y'all, so. Maybe some of y'all been going through the same things with me as well, but I feel like some decision that whatever, yeah, somebody chose to just stay by themselves, realizing they're more happy alone. Okay, I feel like you do have a lot of options in love. You just don't like the ones that you have, okay? But God is just telling you to keep going. Keep going because there's an option that's going to open up for you here, okay? So I feel like somebody um, most definitely was coming to like lie and manipulate you here, trying to confuse you, trying to trick you. But I feel like you caught this person red-handed. That's what I'm hearing. Like, you know, some of y'all could have just blocked this out instantly, you know, just choosing just to stay by yourself. You know, I'm happy alone. I'm happier 
in the skin that I'm in. I don't want to be with no sneaking ass, conniving ass energy. You feel me? It, it's pointless. It's pointless. I'm not never desperate. I'm still alone because I want to. Okay, so seven of cups here. This person is lying, de deceiving. This person has some type of hidden agenda here. This person got some type of need to win here. So I feel like he also feel pulled in two different directions here. So it's something else that's going on in his life that he's trying to block out. But he see you as a wish fulfillment because you're happy and you're living your life. Understand that this man has other options here, okay? This connection is going to lead to some type of disappointment, all right? So just keep waiting because there's somebody that's coming in for you that's going to make a huge change in your life. Yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and get on up out of that. That's why I said it's up to you if you want this person, okay? But I'm telling you, this person just coming to kill, steal, and destroy and manipulate. God saying, look for signs. Look for signs. No, I'm telling you, no. That's, that's not your person. It's not your person, friend. It's not your person. Respectfully, choose a new direction. There's something new that's going to come along your path, and you're going to move that way. 11-11. Yeah. Yep, helpful people. God is finna surround you um, around a lot of people that's going to help you, that's going to encourage you, that's going to uplift you, people that want to see you do good. Also, your angels are supporting you. You might not feel like you have no support in the physical world, but understand in the spiritual world, your angels are encouraging you. They're, they're, they're telling you to keep going, push forward, persevere, 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 persevere. Okay, because you're gonna you're finna get some type of blessing if you just do the work. You feel me? It's already done for you. 11 11, it's already done. You feel me? So just do the work and take action. Cause your angels are gonna support you. They're gonna uplift you either way it go. You feel me? Like like how we all connected in one. How I just shouted that other girl out and told her she needs to start working. You feel me? So something like that could happen where where now helpful people are choosing to really help you. They're choosing to to boast about you. Ooh. People boasting about you in a physical world and in a spiritual world. The spirit world knows so much about you. It's crazy. It's like so many people are talking about you. It's hate for you and it's love for you right now. The angels know your name. They know your story. They know everything about you. Everything that people are telling them. I feel like, I feel like whoever these helpful people is, they're praying for you to win. It's some real people out here really praying for you to succeed, praying for you to win. And I love y'all. I most definitely love y'all if y'all praying for me to win, most definitely. But yeah, somebody want to see you succeed here. But I also see too that somebody could come in and put you in position. Some of y'all might move with this, um, moving in a different direction or choosing a new direction. There's going to be some peaceful resolution here. Yeah, that other person, that's unlikely. So you got to let that other stuff go. You feel me? So if there's going to be a peaceful resolution out of that, I promise you. So just remain positive, be assertive here, and keep waiting and trust in God, okay? Because recovery is going, recovery is, I'm hearing closer than you think. Mm. Recovery is closer than you think. That's why all these options coming in, because they don't want you to get these yes. Because when this yes come in, friend, your life going to change forever. Your life is going to change forever. That's why it's a lot of confusion finna start coming in to you. A lot of people finna start sliding in your DM. A lot of people, a lot of exes finna start coming back. New people finna start coming in. I'm telling you, it's a let go here. Somebody you're gonna have to let go within the next few weeks. This you're gonna, this person, your new person, you're gonna find him this month. You're gonna find that person this month before the month end. Listen to your intuition here and don't stop. Keep going because I promise you, there's something better. Somebody could be trying to clear communication with you. They're getting keep getting information, okay? Because Every everything that glitter ain't gold. That's what I'm hearing. It's peeking out. Yep, Ace of Swords. That's the truth. Some new idea is heading your way. You could have had some some vision of something here, but somebody got some type of idea, some type of vision here, and it's gonna go quick. It's it's gonna move. It's gonna take out fast, friend. I'm, I'm hearing your breath stop. You seen how this how it was? Your breath might stop how fast this is. I'm, I'm, I actually just got on a roller coaster. That's crazy. What the hell? I just got on a whole roller coaster. Like, oh, but it's fun though. I'm smiling. I'm having a good time on this roller coaster. So it's something that's gonna come that's so exciting, gonna be moving so fast. 
but you having so much fun on this roller coaster, girl. Girl, you is drooling. Girl, you is drooling on this roller coaster. But you having so much fun on it. Like, this is the best roller coaster I ever been on in my life. Round two, I need to get back in line again. Can I jump the line? Can I jump the line and get back on this roller coaster? Yeah, some coming. Some coming, friend. Yep, Ace, um, I mean, the star card. So this is going to be like a wish come true. Something you've been praying, hoping for. You're going to get turned into a star. That's what I'm hearing. You could get turned into a star, a public figure. You're hope. Ooh, confirmation. D -d -d. You're you you stand for hope. Ooh, you stand for hope. You show a lot of people. Just just keep going. Keep keep your faith. Keep faith alive. Mm. That's why God is going to put you in position because you stand for hope. You get these. You show these people another way. You show these people to keep waiting. You show these people that it's light at the end of the tunnel. You stand for hope. Yep, King of Swords. So somebody finna come in fast. They're making a fast decision. So when this when this star or whenever this wish fulfillment come in, you're not gonna be able to wait. That's what I'm hearing. It's gonna come in so fast, you're gonna have to make a decision quickly. Okay, because somebody is coming to put you in position here. This is like rescue. Somebody come in and say today, you ask for help. Help is on the way. That's what I'm hearing with this King of Swords. Some of y'all, this person might come in. It might feel like aggression. Or this might be that roller coaster because you see he ran into a bike. Some of y'all might put y'all shoes on, run to that motherfucking car. I'm about to go. I'm about to go. Some of y'all might sneak off. Y'all might not even tell nobody that you're leaving. Y'all just take whatever y'all, whatever little stuff that y'all can get. And y'all just go. Also, too, whoever this person is could sneak off and come your way as well. Somebody who's been waiting a long time. This, this man, it could be a Taurus, um, Virgo Capricorn. Somebody is very stressed out because they see that you're that you're the Empress, that you're it. You're you're the you who they've been looking for here. So they want to get up and take action with this Ace of Wands. They look dick hard too. They're over it too. They're over all the love options that they having. And they want to come in and work on something. Yeah, this person is releasing toxic ways. He's releasing burdens to embrace something that feels balanced and fair here. Yeah, somebody is going to be moving towards you. I feel like you're, you're going to have control over this situation. You have everything that you need. You feel me? Yeah, with this higher thing here, this man most definitely could be a Taurus. But this is going to lead to a higher level commitment. I'm hearing it's your time. Mm. You're finna get a victory. You're finna get a success. See, the problem, I'm hearing people not mad at you per se, right? Let's talk about it. These hang motherfuckers, they not mad at you. They mad that it's you. That's what they mad at. Because if you was broke or if you, if you weren't trying to make it out of your circumstances, they wouldn't be stunning you. They just mad that it's you. That's what I'm hearing. So when this come in, you're just going to, you're some of y'all just going to leave everything and just go. And just go towards this person. This person done been through the same test as you. This person either could be a, a, um, a Taurus, a Cancer, a Capricorn, or a Pisces here. But yeah, somebody stressed out. Somebody finna just up and leave something. And come in your way. This person just want to break. They just want to relax here. Okay. I feel like this person is also going to offer you something as well. But they're very stressed out. Because they feel like you don't accomplish a lot on your own. They see your whatever you creating. They see like, okay, I can grow this here. And this most definitely will be a victory. I'm telling you something coming in out of nowhere. Some of y'all can literally move. I'm telling you and block motherfuckers out. Y'all don't rose above y'all circumstances. And you're blocking people out now. You're letting that pass go. Some of y'all might have was dealing with a fire sign. Probably let that pass go. But I feel like whoever this person is, he's very attractive. He's an entrepreneur. This man wore jewelry. I seen it. Ooh, girl. 
Ice me out. Ice me out. This man dressed really, really good. Call him Mrs. P Mr. Put It On. The way he rocked them clothes. This man got jewelry on, jewelry on, jewelry on. This is finna be a happily ever after for somebody. I'm telling you. You're rising above the, the negativity. You're moving on to peace, of, um, peace and happiness. A lot of conflict. You're leaving that shit. Fuck it. That's what I hear. Two confirmations. Eight of cups. Because you're going to the nine of cups. You're going to a wish fulfillment. Don't forget about your boundaries that you done learned this whole time, okay? Yeah, you done been hurt in the past and stuff like that. I'm not telling you like, oh, B, don't, don't take your problems out on him. You feel me? This is a new person. This is a new slate, okay? So don't take, don't take the old relationship on this person. You feel me? Yeah, you got boundaries and stuff, but it, your heart is healing. You can heal here. You can rest here. This is going to be some type of major life changer. This man has been watching you, watching you work here, waiting. Take it out if it resonates. This man also could be a Virgo as well. And he could be Aquarius as well with that star card. I'm telling you, this is going to bring some emotion out of you. You're going you gonna to be caring. Ooh, look at this, a match. This is the match. You're gonna be, you're gonna be, you're gonna act like a woman. You're gonna be so submissive. And he's gonna be so masculine. And you're gonna be like, yes, daddy. <laughs> That's exactly what I see. That's exactly what I see. Some of y'all right now, y'all single and successful and stressed out, having a hard time sleeping. You feel me? Y'all tired of being alone. But I'm telling y'all, y'all manifesting something new. Why you sitting here lonely, worrying about the future, waiting like, okay, when, when the hell is my results going to come in? When is my boat going to finally get here, right? Friend, there's something that's going to come. Close. It's going to be before this month. That's what I'm hearing. You're going to be straight in recovery, dead fast. Some of y'all, I feel like when y'all step into like your relationship with this person, Okay, and you and you start having like your new life because your new life already started. I mean, by the end, by the ending of this year, y'all, you're not even gonna believe that you went through some of the stuff that you went through. <laughs> you're not even gonna look like this struggle. Mm -hmm. You're not even gonna look like the stuff that you've been through. When you tell your story, people mouths is gonna drop. That's you. You. What? Jazz. Little old Duchess, you went through that. Somebody, that's how people gonna look at you. You're not gonna look like nothing you've been through. Judgment, God is releasing you. He's giving you a second chance or something. I'm hearing a second chance to win. This is an unexpected wake up call. This is gonna, this is something you prayed for. Yeah, I feel like somebody that you was holding on to in the past that you was wishing, hoping, and praying for, this person was forever seeking without finding. I mean, well, forever seeking. You feel me? This is somebody that they don't care. You feel me? Like, they they always feel alone. They always feel a missing void. Like, even, even when something is like a wish fulfillment towards them, they still can't settle down. Cause this person is forever seeking without finding. Like he don't, he you can't satisfy this person's soul in no way. Okay, this is somebody who just who just want to be like this. They want to be the way that they want to be. That's your past person. You might seen you might seen hope in this person, but they don't they don't see hope in themselves. How can you help somebody if they don't want to help themselves? Your life is purpose. Your life means something. That's why God not letting this. Yeah, this man might be a Leo, but I feel like um, because you stay patient, you're you're gonna get some form of communication from some two of cups here. Yep, it's gonna sneak up on you. I really keep that seven of swords keep coming out. I'm telling you, it's gonna sneak up on you, and it's gonna be like, look. Like a lucky break in life. I'm telling you, it's going to be a love connection. A tower moment coming in out of nowhere. Some of y'all predicted this. 
it's going to be a victory. Somebody who get a lot of attention. Somebody who can probably rock crowds out. Take it however it resonates. This man might leave something else in the past as well. He might he might be leaving another connection to come here. But it's a good decision. It's a right decision to make. And he know this is the right decision to make. Because when he come in, let me, let me tell you, because he right here, he right here. I can just go ahead and pull him out. Whatever he gets, he stays. See, he was never in no relationship, ma'am. <laughs> Whatever he's leaving from, this man, this night of, you better, you better Google this night of pinnacles. This night of pinnacles right here. Because when he say he a knight, that's what the fuck he mean. He's a knight, okay? The same little money he gets to this, to little Susie, to all these little city girls, is nothing. Because he has any. Everywhere he go, he leaves a pinnacles. He tell these bitches, we not in no relationship. We not in nothing. We is good. We we kicking it. We having fun. He telling me, folks, I'm focusing on my career. I'm trying to get some money right now. I'm not in no relationship, honey. But shit, if you wanna if you wanna put a little price tag on that little pussy, I most definitely drop a little pinnacle for you because I'm having it like that. That's what he do. But understand when this man gets in that relationship, when he get where he going, he stays there. There's a pinnacle that's on his back. He's going to stay with that pinnacle. If it ain't got put on his back yet, or I feel like this man done, done seen you already. Whoever this person is, he he's new to you, but you ain't new to him. He done seen you already. This man been watching you since December. He been watching you since the end of December. That's what I'm hearing. This is going to be a wish fulfillment for somebody. Somebody's going to go through a spiritual transformation. So wherever he's sneaking off from, he probably don't even gotta sneak. He just don't. He he just don't want to talk. He don't. That's what I'm hearing him say. I don't. I don't want to explain to these bitches why I'm leaving them. Why? Why would I explain to somebody why I'm leaving them if we was never in a relationship? I told the bitch that. I told the bitch we was not in a relationship. So I'm finna go be with my Sagittarius. Yeah, I'm finna. I'm finna go. I'm, I need a break in life. I'm finna go. This person, whoever he was dealing with, was lying and deceiving him. Because she just wanted the jackpot. She just wanted what he had. So yeah, somebody like, I'm finna go. I'm finna, I'm finna go take a risk. I'm finna go to something new. I ain't got time. I ain't got no time. Yeah, this finna be a celebration, okay? This, this man finna give you some type of offer that you cannot resist. Don't mind the mommy cards don't got nothing to say for you. Leo, um, Sage, Aries, they always come out for me though, y'all. <laughs> you know, that card gonna come out every time. And it's coming out on top of helpful people. Abundance is coming. So I feel like some type of success expansion. Also with abundance, abundance means that some of y'all could move, some of y'all could get a new house, could get a new car, or y'all could move out of state. And it's going to be a success. Whatever this new idea that's coming in, it's going to be a success. Too. Yeah, everything is not meant to be perfect. It's meant to be, life is not meant to be perfect. It's meant to be lived here. Yeah, I feel like, I feel like your person had to learn that life life ain't meant to be perfect. It's meant to be lived. This card fell on fell out on the floor. Four 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 fell out. Um, your angels are supporting you. It also say new card coming soon as well. Yeah, whoever you was whoever you was trying to hold on to, take out if it resonates, that person, that person will never say that they're wrong. They'll never tell you. You feel me? They just gonna keep bullshitting around. Yeah, they fell out. The same thing fell out again. They'll never tell you that they was wrong. They're never gonna apologize to you. They just gonna keep coming in and out of your life. That's all they're gonna keep doing. The longer you let it happen, the longer they're gonna keep doing it. 
Yeah, I some of y'all done been through a lot right here with this embracing the pain. Understand that there's something better that's coming towards you. There's most definitely something better that's coming towards you. It's saying embrace the pain. It's something better. So yeah, it might be, it might hurt, it might hurt just to walk away from this person. But you gotta trust in God. You gotta trust that they that they'll deliver you something better. Yeah, we have rap nigga here. This person could be a rap nigga as well, too, that you walked away from. That's what I heard. This person could be a rap nigga as well. I know. Let me tell you something. Everybody enjoys rappers. But I feel like there's some type of um rapper that's gonna come in and give you some type of communication. Or if he's not a rapper, he's some type of social media influencer, or he just he just in the public's eye, okay? Yeah, it's going to come in with some new beginning. This is what you've been asking for. This is what you've been asking for. So it's going to come to you. Your wish is being granted. That's why I told y'all everything that glitter ain't gold. Don't settle for less, okay? If this ain't your person, then, hey, 10, 10, 10, you are very unique here. You're going to be on the come up, friend, okay? You're going to most definitely be on the come up right here. Some of y'all most definitely can move out of state. It said you're a light worker, new house. New house came with January. Some of y'all might get a new house and a new car this month. Take out every resonate. You know when God when God come in, like the longer you wait, girl, and he finally come in, it's like boom, all of a sudden my life changed. All of a sudden, girl, I had all this stuff going on. You feel me now? So that's gonna be somebody's story, okay? That's most definitely gonna be somebody's story. All of a sudden my life changed, friend. Respectfully. Respectfully. So let's get one more card before we head up out of here, y'all. So this ear is inching, y'all. So I don't know what that means. I don't know if that means somebody talking good or bad. I don't know. And also my hand. It was itching earlier. It had stopped itching, but when I first got on the video. Let's get the card out before we go. Romance. Romance is most definitely coming to you, friend. I'm hearing a, with abundance. Some of y'all might really move in with this person. It say be assertive here, okay? So some, some type of romance most definitely could come in with abundance, with some type of expansion. Some of y'all might move, get a new car. I'm telling you, money, career, finances, abundance is everything. Somebody really look at you like an angel, like a gift from God. Like, they ask for God to send them an angel, and they send you, friend. They send you. Look, 11-11 came out out it. I'm telling you, this man I already know you. It's already done. Take action. January here. It's, this man is going to step in before the end of this month. That's what I'm hearing. Before the end of this month, this man is going to step in. Look, somebody rich, somebody rich want to fly you out. They want to get to know you, but you got to come to them. Embracing the pain. They might have seen your pain. They might have seen your struggle. They might have seen something that hurt you. Take it out if it resonates. Look, rap nigga right here. Rap nigga right there. Listen, 999, close of the major cycle in your life, friend. You're finna literally close this chapter out. This chapter, this book is ending. This chapter of this book is ending. New card just came out again. Okay? I don't know if this person hurt you before. Whoever this rapper is, take it out if it resonates for some. Okay, but I feel like whatever is going on, this person sees your pain and they want to be the one to help you. They want to be the one to take you out of that. Mm, yeah, I'm telling you, this man been watching you. Secret Lover been watching you from a fake page. There's some new beginning that's coming in, honey. You're going to look like a prostitute, friend. I'm sorry, it always come out. See the girl. I'm telling you, you're going to look like a prostitute in this new love, love connection, friend. You is, I promise you. So, hey, it is what it is. Ice me out. Bust me down. Bust me down. Bust me down. Y'all know me. I don't stand for that shit. I don't stand for that shit. But I feel like it's going to be some type of image that you're going to help this man create. Because, you know, the girls always boost the men up. That's what I'm hearing. The girls always boost the men up. So, take it however it resonates for some. And understand that you're going to have to be assertive in this situation. You You can't play weak here. I'm hearing this, this right here ain't for the weeks. This ain't for the lanes, honey. When I say that roller coaster was going crazy, 
that roller coaster was going crazy. Honey, people can't handle that roller coaster. Somebody gonna wanna get off that motherfucker. I might have got off and said, oh, this was the best roller coaster ever. Let's ride it again. But somebody else might have said, oh, hell no. Nah. I ain't getting on that damn roller coaster no damn no. That shit is crazy. Girl, I almost died, bitch. So whatever coming in, it's going to be crazy. It's going to be a roller coaster. But some of y'all going to be excited to ride it. Some of y'all going to really be able to handle it. For real, for real. But thank y'all for watching. And your girl is out. Peace.